29-year-old Sulemana Abdul Samed from Ghana stands tall at 7 feet 4 inches tall and is Africa's tallest human. Mr. Samed was diagnosed with gigantism at 22 and has since never stopped growing. Every three months he experiences an increase in height. Who knows, maybe he will be the tallest man in the world soon. Since his diagnosis, Awuche has had monthly checkups due to complications from the condition, including a curved spine. Despite his unusual height, Abdul Samad has lived a relatively normal life, attending school and being employed as a farmer and a mechanic. He has stated that he hopes to marry and have children. Welcome to Afroatista Films. In this video, I introduce you to five exceptional Africans. This list is by no means exhaustive. It's a whole series, so stay tuned. Now, I would like a huge favor from you. Give this video a like. This will greatly help in pushing this video to a larger audience. Thank you, and back to the video. Two, Adut Akech, the most beautiful woman on earth. Adut Akech is a young woman with an extraordinary story. Born in South Sudan, she's a former child refugee who spent the first eight years of her life in Kenya's Kakuma refugee camp before migrating to Australia. She is regarded as one of the world's most beautiful women. Today, Akech is one of the most in-demand models working in fashion, regularly walking for brands including Chanel, Valentino, and Givenchy and starring on the covers of several high-profile magazines. In 2018, Time recognized her as one of the 25 most influential teens of 2018, and in December 2019, she won the Model of the Year Award at the British Fashion Awards in London. Three, Thando Hapo, an exceptionally beautiful albino model. Thando Hopper, born in 1989 in Sebokeng, is a South African model, activist, and lawyer. She is the first woman with albinism to be on the cover of Vogue. While working as a prosecutor, she was scouted by Gert Johan Kotze to work as a model. Hopper aims to portray albinism positively. She was cast as the Princess of Hearts in the 2018 Pirelli calendar, becoming the first South African person of color to appear in it. In 2018, Hopa was recognized with the 100 Women Award from the BBC for her diversity and inclusion advocacy. Thando was cast as Artemis in the British-American miniseries Troy, Fall of a City. She is also famous for winning the Most Stylish Award back in 2013. In 2017, she became the face of Audi's SUV car. Four, Philip Emangwali, one of the most intelligent man on earth. Philip Emangwali is a genius Nigerian computer scientist. He is reputed to be one of the most intelligent people on earth with an IQ of 190, bigger than Einstein's. As a young boy in conflict-ridden Nigeria, Emangwali performed incredible mental exercises such as solving 100 math problems in one hour. When he was 17, he obtained a BS in mathematics. He also earned three other degrees, a PhD in scientific computing from the University of Michigan and two master's degrees from George Washington University. In 1989, emulating Beza's honeycomb construction, Emegwali used 65,000 processors to invent the world's fastest computer, which performs computations at 3.1 billion calculations per second. Dr. Philip M. A. resume is loaded with many other such feats, including ways of making oil fields more productive, which has resulted in the United States saving hundreds of millions of dollars each year. As one of the most famous African inventors of the 20th century, Dr. M. has also won the Gordon Bell Prize, the Nobel Prize for Computation. His computers are currently being used to forecast the weather and to predict the likelihood and effects of future global warming.
5. Ferdinand Omanyala, the fastest man in Africa. Ferdinand Omanyala Omuwa, born January 2, 1996, is a Kenyan sprinter competing in the 60 meters, 100 meters, and 200 meters. In 2022, he won his first international championships with victories in the 100 meters at the Commonwealth Games and the African Championships in Athletics. Omanyala is the African record holder and the fastest man in Africa after clocking a time of 9.77 seconds on September 18, 2021, in Nairobi. In August 2022, he claimed Kenya's first gold medal at the Birmingham Commonwealth Games, becoming the first Kenyan to win gold in the 100-meter race in 60 years. Thanks for watching. Once again, like this video and share your thoughts in the comments section. I will make a great effort to respond. See you.